This is Pioneer 10, a 570-pound spacecraft that was destined to become history's most distant human-made object and the first to leave our solar system. Pioneer became so distant that at the speed of light, its radio signal took 15 hours to cover the 10 billion miles from Earth to the spacecraft and back again. The spacecraft carries 11 instruments that have been used to measure magnetic fields, solar wind, high energy cosmic rays, cosmic and asteroidal dust, and Jupiter's ultraviolet and infrared radiation. In March 1972, NASA launched the Pioneer 10 spacecraft from Cape Canaveral for a 21-month mission to study the giant planet of Jupiter. The Hardy spacecraft accomplished more than two decades of exploration, returning data that characterized the solar system while passing the orbits of every known planet around the sun. In 1983, the spacecraft left the planets behind 2.8 billion miles from the sun. Now six billion miles from Earth, Pioneer 10 continues to provide data for research even in its final days, more than a quarter of a century after its usual lifespan was expected to expire. Pioneer 10 became the first spacecraft to reach Jupiter, the first to use a planet's gravity to increase its velocity, the first spacecraft to come the closest to Jupiter, and the first to exit the orbits of the known planets in the solar system. Navigating the asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter and overcoming Jupiter's radiation environment were considered Pioneer's biggest challenges. Scientists were concerned that the belt of dust and rocks might pummel Pioneer 10 at thousands of miles per hour and destroy the craft. Instead, Pioneer emerged nearly unblemished from both the planet's radiation and the asteroid belt. Now Pioneer 10 is continuing to record the intensity of galactic cosmic rays in the outer heliosphere, the region of solar wind influence, and searching for the heliopause, where the flow of hot gas from the sun comes to a rest as it bumps into the interstellar medium. Pioneer 10 paved the way for future space travel beyond the inner planets as it flew by Jupiter in 1973. Pioneer carries a plaque with an engraved message to extraterrestrials about its home planet. Pioneer will approach 10 stars over the next million years. The closest approach to any star system will be in about 30,000 years. Because the emptiness of interstellar space offers a non-destructive environment to the spacecraft, Pioneer will probably still be traveling amongst the stars when the sun becomes a red giant and destroys the Earth in five billion years. Pioneer is so far from the Earth that its radio signal, equivalent to the power of a nightlight, takes nine hours and 10 minutes to reach Earth. A faint signal will continue to provide a radio beacon that can be used by the Deep Space Network and other facilities. It can also be used to benefit Lunar Prospector, the discovery mission that will inherit the Pioneer Operations Center. Traveling at about 28,900 miles per hour, Pioneer continues its lonely journey into deep space, providing even more information 
about our unknown frontiers.